believe we're on the verge of a major breakthrough. If you have the support of the people, then you'll prevail. Before this loan, at least, people's tax bill actually went slightly down. Elon Musk often talks shop on the small screen and increasingly makes cameos on the big screen, like this one in Iron Man 2. Musk also has screen time in the new Robert Rodriguez film, Machete Kills, about a tough guy who's far from tech savvy. You ready for this? Good for calls, texts, tweets. Watch it, they don't tweet. Rodriguez was toying with the idea of sending his main character to space when he ran into Musk. And I was at a Hollywood party and Elon Musk walks in and starts talking to him about space and he's going, oh, we will go to Mars, we're going to colonize Mars. He sounded like the guy in my movie. So I went to visit his setup and he showed me one of his rockets called the Falcon. I said, why is it called the Falcon? He goes, oh, it's after the Millennium Falcon, I'm a Star Wars fan. I went, oh my God, this is like writing, this thing's writing itself. Musk told Bloomberg West, Robert is a friend of mine and it seemed like a fun thing to do. He even lent Rodriguez footage of rockets taking off to help build the framework for a character played by Mel Gibson. No ahead, his art. I got mine. As for Musk's cameo, it's at the end of the movie as Machete boards a spaceship, and after the scene was filmed, he invited me into outer space. Are you gonna? Will you go? Gotta go. Machete in space for real. Machete in space for real.